It's that time of year just before the start of spring training that the Reds caravan hits the road to travel more than 3,300 miles with stops in five states over the course of four days. Today they made their stop in Pikeville. Broadcasters Chris Welsh, Jeff Brantley, General Manager and President of Baseball Operations Dick Williams, pitcher Drew Storen, catcher Dr Chris Oakey, and Reds Hall of Famer. Eric Davis all made the trip down 23 to visit with Reds Country. Following the autograph session, we caught up with some of the fans within the community and members of the caravan. As in most cases, I like to be a community partner and do things that uh, benefit the community, and we are a sponsor for the Reds uh, throughout the season to broadcast the games. So we have a tremendous number of Reds fans in East Kentucky, so we just like to be a part of you know, to put this uh, event on as well. Every year it's really special. I mean, uh, you know, whether the team has had a good year or a bad year, you really wouldn't know it by when we go out on the caravan, whether it be a radio stop at one of the affiliate stations or one of the big mall stops that they're open to the public. People, I mean, they come out of the woodwork to see the Reds players, to see the former Reds players, to see the general manager, and they always are loaded up with a lot of questions. Born and raised in Cincinnati, so I grew up with it in my blood. I know how important it is. This whole area, it's one of the few things that unites us as a region. And the Reds are important to a lot of people. And you get reminded of that when you come out and, and see all the you know the fans in the, in the offseason wearing their colors. It means a lot to them. You know, they never really get the chance to see any Reds players come here. So I think the caravan is really a good cause for the community. And I think we should just keep on doing it.